A massive earthquake in Mexico has reduced dozens of buildings to rubble and left an unknown number of people trapped under debris. The death toll currently stands at around 140 people, but that figure is expected to rise. Now, the Korean embassy there is trying to contact and help any Korean nationals in the quake struck region and have been unable to reach a Korean man in his 40s who was in the region at the time of the earthquake. Now, Kim Hesung with the latest. Panic, piles of rubble, and flames. A magnitude 7.1 earthquake struck central Mexico on Tuesday afternoon, toppling buildings, killing at least 140 people, and trapping an unknown number of others beneath fallen debris. Thousands more ran for their lives in panic as the ground shook. The ground started moving. It was very strong. Windows started to break. People started to leave their homes. This building in front collapsed. The U.S. Geological Survey says the Epic Center was in Puebla State, about 120 kilometers southeast of Mexico City, striking at a depth of 51 kilometers. Most deaths occurred in Puebla, Morelos, and Mexico states. The earthquake hit only hours after drills were held across the nation on the 32nd anniversary of a quake that killed around 10,000 people. It also comes less than two weeks after an 8.1 magnitude quake hit Mexico, killing at least 90 people. Mexican President Pina Nieto has called a meeting of the National Emergency Committee to evaluate the situation and coordinate response measures. Until further notice, Mexico City's airport, schools, as well as the stock exchange will remain closed. Millions are without power, and rescue workers in the Mexican capital are now in a race against time to find survivors. Kim Hyesung, Arirang News.